In this video, we are going to learn how to schedule and nest parts. This maximizes efficiency and minimizes waste. We have here a sample part in our database with a saddle on one end and a miter on the other. We will schedule and nest two of these. The first thing we need to do is select the part and then click the Schedule Parts button. Next, we'll change our count to our desired quantity of two and then click the OK button. Next, we'll switch to the Scheduled Parts tab. We see both our parts here. We'll select both of them, and then we'll click the Nest Parts button. Now, we'll need to ensure that the following three parameters are correct. Pipe length, nesting distance, and unused pipe length. Then, we can click the Nest Parts button. And once that finishes, we can go to the Pipes tab. And there we see our nested pipe, ready to be sent to the cutting machine. Next, we'll move it and rotate it a bit to see the results of the nesting and how it overlapped the parts to minimize waste. I can click on individual parts in the pipe to get information about them. And there is also information about the whole pipe here. Next, we'll select the pipe and click the Send to Machine button to send it to our Watts cutting machine. We get a confirmation dialog to let us know the pipe has been sent, and we'll click OK. This brings up a web view of our pipe and the parts in it, so we can see what has been sent to the machine. Now we can click on the Machine Operation tab to see the machine ready to go.